Let's continue. Oh, did I press record? Okay, I did. Back in game. That's mission available. Your higher arc is apparently unaware of the danger closing in around him. If you desire his safe return, you will send your warriors to these coordinates now. Okay, let's go save the high arc. Damn, Alarak. I guess Alarak is like in um, Heart of Swarm. Uh, what's that guy name? You had that Primal Zerg join. Like halfway through the campaign. So, get these random guys joining. This path will lead your forces to Artanis. I have done as I promised, Dark Templar. Now go tell your hierarch. I am waiting for him. Matriarch, our High Templar have volunteered to aid you. The loss of the Kala was not easily borne. But we are ready to serve once again. Templar, I thank you for your bravery in this dire time. We will recover our hierarch. Damn, yeah, those zealots look pretty cool with the, the battle axe. Just the darkness will be repelled. Feedback? Oh, no storm? Just feedback? Okay. Olak Natal. For Unleash psionic storms, brothers. Let these hybrid thralls feel the wrath of the Templar. Our spirit oh. is indomitable. And Taro Tassadar. I heed the call. Yeah, that's pretty cool, man. I will. I have heard of these Terran Spectres. Focus their energies into a feedback loop. They will not bear it. As ever, I serve. Oh, what the hell was that? To me, oh, crap. Swarm. Templar, join us quickly. Oh, that's Artanis. Oh, we saved Artanis. Vorazun, your forces have arrived just in time. Amon has opened a portal to the void. It must be shut down before it tears us apart. Agreed. My swarm and I will bear the brunt of Amon's power and buy you time. But it's up to you to seal that portal. The gateway draws power from these void crystals. We will need to destroy them if we are to seal the gate. Then it shall be done. Okay, we're back in the game. Or it's three. The darkness is approaching my hive cluster, Artanis. I hope you're getting ready to disable those crystals. I'm calming. I'll continue sending as many Zerg as I can spare to help you. Fight well, Templar. Well, you better hold my uh, my back over here. Right. Let's remember to make a forge this time. Man, even with the uh, with the no probes on gas, it's still taking forever to start. You have not enough minerals. No minerals. Once more. Oh crap, I built a. I, there's a ramp here. Hierarch, I am detecting several energy sources hidden across the temple. They appear to be Zel Naga vessels, ancient power sources. If we can locate them, I should be able to use their energy to free up additional solarite from the Spear of Adun's core. You must construct additional pylons. Pylite for iron. You know, let's just attack. I don't feel like waiting. 
to uh Ah oh, man. Unity through purpose. Never mind, let's let's desert handle that. Taro Tassadar. Olak. We've secured a Zelnaga vessel, Karax. Prepare for transfer. Unbelievable. Despite eons of inactivity, okay. these devices uh, are still at full power. No feedback here. Let's go back, let's go back. Oh, that really sucked. That really sucked. I did not expect to be owned like that. Wait. Yeah, let's wait uh, for these guys. Cannon fodder. Wait for the cannon fodder here. I did that. Uh, it's my probe. Get some DTs. Uh, what else do I need? I got a robo, right? I don't have a robo. Crystal destroyed. Sensors are showing three more remain, Hierarch. Okay. I think my base is, is pretty defended. Make some. Um... Oh, I don't have a cybernetic core. Oh my god. I don't have a cybernetic core. I'm so used to the mission already making it for me. Too many DTs here. Oh, crap. Oh, man, that's why. I knew I was missing two, uh, I was missing units. Destroy it as 
Okay, got this. Make some units. Ah, no, 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 cancel, 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 cancel. Two crystals destroyed. I suspect Amon's forces uh, will not let us take the next two so easily. I'm going to secure a crystal myself, Artanis. Join me if you wish. Hybrid are moving to attack our nexus point. Ready our defenses. And Aris, give your order. We will atone. Our light lives on. Upgrade complete. Okay, let's uh, go up here. There is no uh, that's enough. What? For now. Let the DTs do the work. Oh, oh. Oh, no. The DT, the DT. Our warriors can destroy it whenever you are ready. Nice. Uh, hi. Artanis, hurry up and disable those void crystals. My hive cluster is taking a beating. Only one remains, and the portal is growing unstable. We must destroy the final crystal, and do so with haste. Hybrid inbound on our nexus point. Warriors, intercept them. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work, right? How do you go up here? Oh crap. Man. I A moved into that. I shouldn't have done that. Upgrade complete. You must construct additional pilots. My brood is pushing towards a crystal. I'm gonna wait. Wait for the next uh, blue wave here. Let them be cannon fodder. Oh, not yet. Watch this. I know that's that, that's like cheating, yo. I didn't get the solar right. I forgot all about the solar right. Let this be a reckoning. From this point forward, we stand united. We shall turn back the tide of Amon's darkness. Onar. We fought well this day, Kerrigan. Join us. Together, we can defeat Amon and send him back into the void. My swarm was broken here, Artanis. I'll need time to rebuild my forces. There is no time. 
My people are being consumed. Their very flesh turned into Amon's own. I cannot wait. Then you must do as I have. Gather allies, subjugate enemies, do whatever you can to ensure victory. Survival is never pretty. We are very different leaders, but I thank you nonetheless. Until we meet again. Solar powered. Artanis, Hierarch of the Twilight Council, Warlord of the Templar. I had expected so much more. Arrogance! Watch <laughs> your words, or my blade will watch them for you. Oh, that's hardly a way to speak of one who saved your master's life. You care little for my survival, Alarak. What is the true reason you've come to me? Our god broke his ancient covenant and cast us low. These are lies, Artanis. I am the liar. Are you not but a lie incarnate machine? Prototh. Speak your peace, Alarak. The Talgarim's death fleet amasses its slain, awaiting the start of a full-scale invasion. I come with an offer. You will aid me in invoking a challenge for the right to rule my kind as High Lord. And in return, I will grant you a cessation of hostilities between our people. Phoenix. Rally my advisors. It appears we have much to discuss. That evil Protoss? Ah, uh, Artanis. I believe I will serve you more effectively from here. Nothing was as it seemed. We came to Olmar to awaken the Zelnaga and receive their aid. Instead, Amon nearly killed us. I fear Zeratul's prophecy is no longer clear to me. He was closer to the truth than I thought. The Zelnaga did rest here. Had they lived, I think they would have given us their aid, just as Zeratul said. If nothing else, I will grant him that. Matriarch, your words surprise me. Perhaps your council has proved influential in some regards. Then I will endeavor to give you more of it. I said some regards, Hierarch. Not all. Now what is this romance thing going on here? Rohana, do you not see why you must sever your nerve cords? I cannot allow you to fall under Amon's sway again. The collar was created in our darkest moment. Only its light was able to bind our people to give us unity. We are born into it. And when we die, our spirits become one with it. It is worth fighting for. And now Amon uses it against us. It sustains his existence. Its time must end. Artanis, through the collar, our every thought and emotion are made as one. I feel his thoughts and emotions swirling like a vortex throughout. He does not realize it, but here, within the collar, he is vulnerable. How? Just as he can see into me, I can see into him. We can use this to our advantage, Hierarch. I know that it. He's the Mind Flayer. It is not worth it. Please, I only ask for time. Assignment? Powerful psionic warriors have joined our ranks, Hierarch. You must choose among them. Storm. Oh, it's permanent. Permanent takes control of enemy unit. I do like Storm, but you get that playing ladder. This is, uh, this is do something different with the Dark Archon. More? Alarax warriors have joined our force. Oh, sentry! I need to do the sentry. Taldarim, quite unlike anything I have seen before. Wait, I did do the sentry. Oh, wait, new. These ones are new. Dark Templar, Avenger, Blood Hunter. What is this? 
Where does my prey hide? Disables enemy units and structures. You know what? I've had a lot of Dark Templar die, but I've never seen him death recall yet. So this sucks. The Shadow Fury. Let's go Shadow Fury. Alarak's vanguards have joined our cause. It seems our surprises have no end. Uh, Shadow Cannon. This shoots the air. Order me to war. That's pretty cool. I'll take that. Dragoon. These purifiers have joined our army, Hierarch. It seems they are willing to serve you. For Where now. shall we march? Man, you get that in the ladder. Adept. Hey. Uh, Zealot. Carax has utilized data from Glacius to bring the robotic sentinels online. Use them the wisely, Hyrule. Shall be purified. I like this. Sentinel. Uh, did I get a BNet message? Uh, let me check real quick. Um, I don't know what I don't know what that beep was. I guess it's nothing. Solar core. Hyrock, I believe I have found a way to save our people. As Zeratul foresaw, this keystone can indeed be our salvation. Explain yourself. As we have seen, the keystone was designed to be found and assembled by those who would ascend to become Zelnaga. After leading them to Ulnar, it would also expel its stored energy to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. The keystone siphons energies and redistributes essence, matter, information, consciousness. To this device, they are all the same. I see that now. This is how it cleansed Kerrigan. It extracted the essence that forged her into the Queen of Blades. Then it used that energy to release Amon from the Void. If I can discover how to control the Keystone, we could use it to extract Amon from the Kala and save our people. Then Zeratul has led us to hope after all. Continue your research, Karax. We have a war to take to Amon. Wash my hands a little bit. I have come to a realization, Hierarch. I am little more than a clone of your friend Phoenix. The Kangarine speaks truth. I am synthetic. A replication. A lie. You've been reading the ship's archive. What did you find? My death. My rebirth as a Dragoon. And then, my death at the hands of this Queen of Blades. I am not Phoenix, yet I hold his memories as if they were my own. I must have time to consider this. You are a warrior, Phoenix. Whether you identify yourself as my old friend or not, know that I believe in you. And I believe you will help me destroy Amon's armies and save our people. Do not waver because of this knowledge. I will try, Hierarch. I had to make sure the audio was okay. 75. Oh, I need a hundred. Okay, go back to the bridge. You must know Amon will destroy you. If you have such faith in him, why are you here? Oh, I merely voice the inevitable. I know the true power of what you face. I said destroy you, not I. I have seen enough. His hubris will be his undoing. It is a flaw I also see in you. <laughs> I believe I like you, Hierarch. Your bravery is commendable. Join me then. 
Together, we can defeat him. I cannot tether my fate to yours. Hatred does not burn within you as it does in me. You do not see through the agony of knowing all you believed in is a lie, and that your only solace is found in the destruction of your betrayer. No. Amon corrupted my people, and now turns them into a hybrid Aren't they the same? Aren't they both Protoss? My rage burns brighter than a thousand suns, and soon all will see my wrath unleashed. Then this is something I hope to witness. I think what's like evil Protoss? I don't know. What travel? The void portal within Ulnar has been sealed, but a greater threat looms. Amon is transforming our people into a host form. While we were focused upon Ulnar, he has unleashed the full might of the Golden Armada, using our own weaponry to eradicate life from planets across the Kapulu sector. Our current forces are not powerful enough to engage the Great Fleet, but Amon's other servants run rampant across the sector. Then we should strike immediately, eliminate his outlying forces. The ancient purifiers were designed for war. If we reactivate them, we can build our armies and destroy Amon's Zergroods in one fell swoop. Assuming they do not turn on us hmm. first, I'm thinking the Phoenix. purifiers possess no loyalty, no honor. You waste time bickering. The Taldarim's death fleets are your threat. I alone can challenge Malash for the right to rule and bend his army to my will. Do not forget Mobius Corps. They are rumored to operate from a hidden base where they forge a hybrid army to serve, even now. This is true, but we cannot engage them without knowing where they are. Vorazun, send your most elite Dark Templar to scour the sector. For now, Kerax, your focus must remain with the Keystone. The survival of our people depends on our actions in the days to come. It falls to the firstborn to stop the coming oblivion. That war council is pretty cool. Okay, let's do... Let's do... I don't know. Since that was on this side. Colossus. There is no salvation within Ulnar. And yet, we indeed... I think Phoenix is gonna betray them. I have made a decision many of you will not agree with. During my time with Phoenix, I have seen that the Purifier program, under the right guidance, may be reborn. History has shown the Purifiers cannot be controlled, Artemis. They do not have to be. These personalities, like I, will have free will. We do not have enough Purifier matrices to create more like Phoenix. You cannot possibly be considering what I think you are. The original purifiers are housed in orbit above the forest world of Endion, sealed within their warship, Cybros. I have seen through Phoenix that these warriors may be valuable to us. Perhaps the Conclave misunderstood them, treating them as simple robots and not proud Templar. It tried to control them. And they rebelled, attacking their creators. Would you not rebel against a slave master? I have heard your counsel, and I have chosen to go to Endion. We leave at once! It's pretty cool. The purifier stasis grid is still intact. We'll have to destabilize it from the generator below. I'm detecting a massive Zerg infestation on the surface. They can't be Kerrigan's. Amon's brood. This will not be easy. Mission available. Disable stasis locks. 
The shield emitters on India must be disabled if we are to react. Okay, let's go. Let's remember to get the solar right. Uh, the last mission, I forgot all about uh, getting the solar right. Cyrus, the vault of the purifiers. It is fortunate that Avon's brood has been unable to penetrate its stasis grid. I now have access to Endion's records. Hmm. The stasis grid is sealed by complicated locking mechanisms. They can only be destabilized by a certain device. The megalith. I'll begin recovering it now, so it may work on the locks. It will need protection. These forests already crawl with Zerg abominations. Then we shall clear them out. If I may, Hierarch, this facility once developed powerful weapons for the Empire. Ah, I have heard tale of the mighty Colossi, steam cliffs besieging enemies from afar. Let us see how they fare against the Zerg. Yeah, Phoenix sounds... he sounds different. Oh, why? The hell is this? Oh, that was weird. The Zerg are coming from that cave. If we fire on the rock formation, it will seal the opening. What is this crap? I don't even know what good that would do. Check point. Well done. The area is secure. Warp coordinates for our nexus point are locked. Karax, activate the megalith. This tree? Authorization in progress. The Megalith should be ready shortly, Hierarch. We will monitor its status and alert you when it is online. This tree map looks pretty cool though. I give it that. Uh... The Megalith systems will take a few moments to activate. It will be ready to move out soon. Okay, I got... In the meantime, I've upgraded our robotics facilities to construct Colossi. You can warp them in whenever you wish, Hierarch. Okay, I got robotics facility, robotics bay, cybernetic core, warp gate. Okay, got it. Um, you have not enough minerals. Okay. Uh, where is this? You have not enough The hour is upon us. Damn, that looks that looks pretty cool, yo. I'm not gonna lie, that, that looks cool. Oh I got zealots. The megalith should be finishing up shortly. We should ensure that we have enough forces to defend it. I know, I know. You have not enough minerals. The megalith is online. We must ensure it reaches the spaces locks safely. Your allies are oh, crap. What the hell is this?
Why is it attacking on its own? Okay. Um. The megalith has reached the first stasis lock. It will be safe below the surface as it does its work. Get a. I don't know. I love these these things. I am detecting Zerg movement. Warriors, ensure none reach our nexus point. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. The hour is upon us. Where did the uh Oh he's back there? You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. Oh man, it sucks. You must construct additional pylons. The megalith is almost done with this lock. I would advise you to make preparations for its next move. I should get more, uh... Sensors show the first stasis lock has been disabled. The megalith is relocating to the next one. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. We made the enemy in battle. Okay, okay. Oh man. The hour is a pass. School is I was upgrade. You know, I, I don't even think I need the immortals, it's just I like making it making them because of the uh The Megalith has arrived safely at the second stasis lock. It shall be brought down shortly. Interesting. I believe this facility used power cores of incredible size to provide energy for experiments. They should be hidden somewhere within these hills. If our warriors can destroy them, we can claim the Solarite components within. I should, knew I should have made more classes. Oh, hold up. The first power core has been secured. Warping it aboard now. What is this? Okay, now I, I know I need more classes now. I, I will serve. I messed up making all these um. The megalith's work is nearly complete. It will move again soon. Oh crap! Go back over here. Okay, we're going to move here. 
Stasis lock disabled, and the grid is now at 60%. The megalith is en route to the third lock now. You have not enough minerals. I have returned. The canyon grows narrow ahead. Crawlers, they're rooting on the ridge. Brace for incoming fire. Damn. Well, good thing I made the uh, the mortals for the uh, Your allies are in battle. Yo, the mortals are turned out to be pretty good. What the hell is this? Okay, where's my... I like that, uh, sh I love that shooting thing, man. Well done, warriors. The Megalith is disabling the third lock. have been obtained. I'll begin working on them immediately. Okay. Base is under attack. Uh, I think they have it. I don't want to warp in any units. Man. Destabilized. The megalith will relocate shortly. I have returned. I am needed in good command. You know what? Let me get that. I hate this. <laughs> I don't know why. has been disabled and the megalith is on the move my readout shows cybros beginning to awaken from stasis only two remain hierarch speak your this warrior awakens i am detecting a large number of zerg bioforms in the cave network ahead man we can use the terrain to our advantage Toggle the rock formations near the entrance and seal the Zerg within the caves. number of Zerg have been detected in the caves ahead. Exercise caution. I'm gonna leave two immortals at my nexus. I'm tired of uh, getting attacked there. Phase 
Link authorized. The Megalith is now disabling the fourth lock. Guide my blade. This warrior awakens. Just in case I get attacked. I didn't get all my upgrades. There it goes. I knew I was going to get attacked. Damn, bitch. That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage, yo. Lock destabilization is nearly finished. The megalith will disembark soon. There it goes. Should be finished. What? There's one more? The lock is down and the megalith is traveling. Stasis grid at 20%. Wait. I'm detecting activity in the Zerg hive nearby. They're reinforcing the last lock. I thought they, I thought the mission was over. between the megalith and the last stasis lock. Our only option is to fight through it. We just gotta let the zealots die. Let's make more zealots. This warrior awakens. Seismic disturbance detected. Nidus worms are inbound on your location. Nidus worms. Uh... You must construct additional pylons. This warrior awakens. Upgrade complete. Oh, let's go up here. Well, good thing I made those zealots. is destabilizing and the grid is down we've done it cybros is free from stasis recall our forces from endion's service we take this battle to cybros i thought i was on cyber oh wait cybros is the um thing i was on indian i forgot about that The Spear of Adun has finished replicating a new comp- I assume your plan is to bind these robotic warriors to your will. They will be allowed their freedom, much like Phoenix. Making slaves of them is what led to their revolt before. Oh, this foolish <laughs> idealism taxes my patience. Idealism? They are the replications of our greatest champions. We seek to free your people from Malash, and yet you desire to enslave mine? 
I care not for freedom. It softens a people. I will dethrone Malash and save my kind from oblivion. But they will not be free. They will serve me. Freedom is a delusion granted to the weak by the strong. Gotta kill Alarak. You speak as Amon does. For the sake of your life, that will change. Instill the Phoenix Machine as the new executor of the Purifiers, and use them as the tools of destruction they were built to be. Hey, they're still, uh, replicants. Hierarch, my scouts are tracking the movements of the gold. Why was Endion chosen as the world Cybros was to orbit? For thousands of years, it has been a research retreat. Here, Protoss scholars secluded themselves from political affairs to focus on the task of devising technology that would benefit the Empire. The Psi Matrix was first conceived here. When it was decided that the purifiers would be shut down, they became a symbol of achievement, but also the dangers of it. So they were brought to a research colony. Where better than a place where our greatest scientists resided, constantly improving Cybros's stasis field. And how many resided on the world below? 800,000 Kalai. Wow. A contingent of Templar. 800,000? The deaths were swift. 800,000. We have received new robotic siege technology hierarch. Please make your selection. Combat Amplify. What is this? Boost attack range of friendly units. I don't know, I like I still like this thing. Robotic siege. Choose a faction. Walks up and down cliffs. Attacks at fire to the ground. Scarab? Oh my scarab. I don't like this. I like that better. I need five more, I can't believe it. I need five more. Cyros will not be able to resist the Zerg for long. We should move quickly if we hope to save the purifiers. I require your honest counsel, Phoenix. Do you believe the purifiers will join us? I do not know. They may harbor rage, resentment for the actions of our forebears. The Daylong is not the Conclave. We are united in purpose like never before. And that is why the Purifiers must be allowed to choose their fate for themselves. Without freedom, a people can be controlled, but never united. This is true. And yet, the Firstborn have ill need of another enemy. And I believe in you to not create one. Your actions determine the future for both the Templar and the Purifiers. But now is the time to act, Hierarch. You are right. The way forward may be difficult, but it is necessary. Thank you, my friend. Man, Phoenix looks like he's gonna betray us. Carax, the stasis grid is down. We must act now. If we can bring Cybros online, the battle station should begin to defend itself. And the purifiers? They have lain dormant for millennia. They may still harbor anger towards us. If they turn on us, we will have to fight. We failed them before, not understanding what it was we had birthed. These personalities may be replications, but they are alive. After spending so much time with Phoenix, I share your belief. Okay, Bridge. Oh. What now? With the stasis grid down, the Zerg have begun infesting the surface of Cybros. We do not have long.
press the any key. Archives claim their infestation already spreads across the surface. And Amon's hybrid have begun fortifying the hives. We must hope for the aid of the purifiers to win this battle. Indeed. According to the station schematics, Cybros's power architecture is divided into four distinct quadrants. Each is sealed by three null circuits. Destroying all of the circuits in a quadrant should restore its power, activating at least some of the purifiers. We will need to keep a watchful eye upon the core matrix. If the Zerg destroy it, Cybros falls as well. Cybertron will not fall. Okay. Unto death. We should try to locate the null circuits as soon as it is safe to do so, Hierarch. Artanus, there are unpowered cannons placed near the core matrix. With enough fortification, this would be a defensible position. I love these, uh, damn, I don't have enough. One more. I want one more. You know what? Screw that. Let's just cheat. And do that. As fate grant me my end. A Zerg force is preparing to move on the core matrix. Warriors, defend the core. Oh crap! There, a null circuit. Destroy it. And power should begin to flow again. So shall I. Oh, crap. Oh, I love that purifier. I forgot the purifiers have two lives. I should make more zealous if, if they live twice. But I love this. We should head out and destroy the null circuits. The purifiers will attack the Zerg and slow their attacks upon the core. As fate decrees, so shall I suffer. Oh crap. Run! Detecting the purifier awakening on its own. Wait, something is amiss. The AI has gone rogue. AI? Its solarite memory lattice has grown irreversibly unstable. We should disable it. At least we can put its solarite to use. Energy flow increasing exponentially. It's working. The purifiers are activating. I am Executor Clolarian. I address the leader of the Firstborn. Executor Clolarian, 
Your deeds are taught to all Templar, even to this day. Seize your adulation. Why do you seek the purifiers? Brothers, you were created to protect the Empire. Yet we did not treat you as you deserved, as true Templar. I implore you to forgive our ancestors' mistakes, to take up your ancient charge once more, and join us as equals. Whoa, 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 whoa. We will see if you speak truth. You will aid us in purifying this alien threat. Only then shall we discuss this further. Sentinels! Advance upon the alien stronghold! Purify the invaders! Let me get, uh... Man, I'm, I'm really, uh... Slacking. The Zerg broods are reacting to our battle plan. They have begun guarding the null circuits. Oh, this guy. Okay, I need um I need another gateway. The Zerg are attacking from the northeast. They're trying to break through our nexus point. Oh crap, they're coming up from here. <laughs> the core matrix. Where are you attacking from? Okay. Uh, where's my? I built the uh, thing in the wrong place. Let's go down here. You could come down here. Wait, they all died? What am I supposed to do? Destroy null circuits. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. Uh, what else do I need? I need... I don't need that. Get a battery shield. Upgrade complete. Battery shield. Let's go. You know this attack. Get some more uh base is under attack. <laughs> ah, I just warped in a whole bunch of crap.
Why aren't they attacking? Aw oh, man, I didn't get them hotkey. They are... I'm so, uh, what do you call it? Not even, uh, focusing right now. Engaging foe as fate decrees. As the chain... Our pylon is under attack. Oh, man. Um, make some more of these things. We advance. The enemy shall be purified. Willingly. Hierarch, the hybrid are moving to strike the core matrix. We must tighten its defenses. Not even paying attention to what I'm doing. Willing wait, 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 let them let them go in first. I'm going to uh You must construct additional pylons. Son of a This warrior awakens. Oh crap, we didn't get this guy yet. Circuits is located here. Oh man, it's more. How much are there? The third quadrant is coming online now. Cybros is at seventy five percent power. Cybros, brothers, our time has come. Eliminate the alien bioforms with extreme prejudice. I bid you listening. I will. This warrior awakens. 
willingly. Wait, that's it, right? Unquestioned. How is this? I obey. Upgrade complete. As fate decrees. Uh, man, I had these guys all along. Hey, did I lose my cyber? I lost my cyber core. I lost my, lost my cyber core. I don't even know. I don't remember when I lost it. I don't remember losing a cyber core. Take caution, Hierarch. The Zerg presence is overwhelming in that region. We should attack the snow circuit. Destroying it will help us awaken the purifiers. Damn. I should have used the uh, solar thing. I don't even have to kill this. The Zerg bases have been destroyed. We can disable the null circuits freely now. That's it. Seals are fully unlocked. Cypros is awakening. This warrior awakens. What? Hierarch. Cybros is I didn't finish the um and the purifiers are cleansing the station of the Zerg. I didn't finish the mission. Fight on, brothers. Slaughter them to the last. Wait. I've been disconnected from Cybros' systems. The core is activating. It's going to fire. Larian, what are you... Commencing purification. I knew it. Traitor. I knew the purifiers were traitor. Damn, it's like a Death Star. Oh, he's killing the Zerg. Zerg biosigns disappearing. The surface of Endion has been cleansed of life. It is over. Damn, we killed everything.
Executor Clolarian, you have awoken during the Firstborn's darkest hour. You have shown us that the Purifiers are a mighty force that could turn the tide of this war. I ask you now to honor your sacred charge as Templar and fight beside your brethren as you did before. You are no different than the Conclave. Once again, you try to control us. No. I wish to make amends for our past failures. I have fought battles alongside one of you. Phoenix, the one you are linked with. The Conclave feared your kind, but they are no more. I know you are true Templar. I have seen it. I ask that we stand as one, or none of us shall stand at all. I will counsel with the others. They are deliberating. Deliberating. If we are to follow, we would ask the entity Phoenix to speak for us. There is much about this time we do not yet understand. But as long as you hold to your word, Hierarch, the Purifiers shall join the Firstborn. Nice. Hierarch, I have powered up a new ship subsystem. You can review it in the solar core. This errand of yours has been a waste of our time. We should leave for slain. The purifiers will be a useful addition to our forces. I would hardly call this an errand. Yes, but as we already discussed, you chose to give them freedom, hoping that they will do as you command. Do not presume to lecture me about my decisions, Tal Darim. But I so enjoy our exchanges. Sure. The War Council. These purifiers have joined our army, Hierarch. It seems they are willing to serve you. For yeah. now. I answer the call. Uh, I guess so. I don't know. Amon's presence within the Kala grows stronger. He is becoming harder to resist. You risk much for this, Rohana. He believes all suffering, all conflict, results from the Zelnaga's infinite cycle. That it must end. Yes, he has made this clear. But you see only the surface. Underneath, a silent hatred roils within him. A prideful resentment that would see all worlds burn. The hybrid are the true face of Amon. He wishes not only for the Zelnaga's creations to be set aside, but for them to suffer. Okay, Solicor. I have been analyzing the purifier bodies en masse. Their systems function more effectively when in proximity to each other. Outlying protocols can be offloaded to unoccupied cores. What does any of that mean, Karax? Their data web was designed to replicate the sense of the Kala. Oh. They are connected to each other. Interesting. Yes, however, it is a synthetic representation. There is no emotional wave. They're on the, the internet. The engineers who built them could not imagine how they could ever be seen as Protoss without the light of the Kala. If only our ancestors could see us now. So the uh, purifiers, they're on a cloud <laughs> finally deploy whoa this is pretty cool too reconstruction beam what is this passive ability I want dark deploy phoenix we have achieved an incredible feat friend phoenix Phoenix. I have been thinking about that name. It is the moniker of another. I do not believe I should use it any longer. Man, I knew Phoenix was going to change. I am not he. Phoenix was the bravest warrior I have ever known. He faced terrible odds and emerged victorious. 
Hawks slayed enemies the likes of which most cannot even comprehend. And yet, you have proven to be of equal bravery. He would have been honored that a warrior such as you bore his name. And so am I. Your words honor me, Hierarch. But one day, I must find my own path and my own name. Why does he sound so sinister, man? I don't trust Phoenix. Well, let me see the time. It's an hour and 20 minutes. We just finished the purifier uh, missions. So I guess uh, we let's end it on that note. So I'm going to stop the stream and stop recording. And we'll play... I don't even know what the next missions are. But we'll play the next missions at a later time. Okay. Okay, bye-bye.